The upcoming Trading Post rewards are kind of epic. Now, Blizzard did a big announcement yesterday for a two-month. They talked about July and August Trading Post rewards. I'm going to pause the music real quick. Let's watch this epic uh, drop of a video that they released yesterday. Yes. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Get ready. Bust your nuts, guys. Oh. Fuck yeah, the Spectral Tiger pet. And I remember, these are two months of rewards here that they're showing. The Alabaster mounts. Come back soon. Get those tendies. Fantastic. I mean, the Nether Drake's gonna steal the show. Let's be honest. Yeah, that's great. Good stuff, good stuff. Epic little video there. Um, and again, this is two months of shit. A lot of the stuff you see here is for August. Sam, doing all right. First day, being jobless. Thanks to robots. But how are you? I'm all right, man. Hey, don't let it get you two down, my man. Even me. I have lost my job. It happens. I just uh, get back on your feet and get back in the game. And for now... It is what it is. What are you going to do? You know, things are out of your control. You do what you can. You got like an hour of an intro? Of course I do, Sam. Get the fuck out of here. What do you kind of stream you think this is? We play games here? We do fucking intros for an hour. Now that's the Spectral Tiger mount. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I honestly thought when I first saw it. But no, it's the pet. All right, anyways, for July, the main thing is, yeah, we see a couple things coming back here. This is having the sword on the trading post is kind of badass. But we see a lot of uh, items here, you know. Get your... Is this the Gul'dan staff again? Yeah, get that. These are the July items. You know, a lot of it, yeah, it looks sexy. That's fine. Get it. Got it. Good. Get your Viking helm with your cock, uh, you know, with a cock over your nose. That looks good, too. Uh, you're, you know, the thought of somebody using this weapon is so barbaric. This thing is not very sharp. This would literally bludgeon your enemies to death. The Dragul Hammer, is that what it is? I mean, this thing is this thing is intense. Yeah, here it is, the Spectral Tiger Cub. Not the mount. That's going to be a Twitch drop one day. Yeah, don't I wish. The Spectral Tiger Cub. Uh, Tyrael's Charger, once again. Uh, wasn't this on the... No, that wasn't. It was a Spectral horse that I'm thinking of. Yeah, Tyrael's Charger is going to be on there. Uh, the Scorpion, you get a nice little purple shirt there. Uh, you know... Your capes, your swords, your weapons, all that shit. Yes, the Gul'dan staff. Uh, decent looking shield, the Conquest two-handed sword, and of course, the Nether Drake mount. Now, I will say one thing about the Nether Drake mount. We had seen this data mine a little bit, a little while back. Uh, I have to say I'm a bit disappointed. I'm a bit disappointed. As somebody who played through Burning Crusade back in the day, and I sucked at the game at that time, mind you, I could never get a Nether Drake. Because I didn't know how rep worked back then. I'd know what the fuck I was doing. I was just playing WoW all the time. And I sucked at it. But I never got a Nether Drake. And I always idolized those who did. I was always like, man, that guy's badass. He's got a Nether Drake. And I was thinking maybe we'll get a shot at him. I'm telling you, the one thing that threw me off the horns. I really do wish the horns weren't there. As a, as a purist fan of the Nether Drakes, uh, if you remember the Nether Drakes, they don't have these fucking horns. Yeah. Something's never changed yet, Typo. Fuck you. So, uh, I kind of do wish the horns weren't there, I'm not gonna lie, but this is cool. You know, I'm gonna obviously, I'm gonna do what I can to get this. I get it really just by raiding with you guys, so, uh, we'll make sure we all get these nether drakes. Not bad looking, but I do wish the horns weren't there, if I'm being completely honest with you guys. On to the next thing. Oh, this. Hardcore is coming to retail. That's what this is. If you guys remember, we reviewed these armor sets. These are the infinite dragon colorways of uh, some of the most beautiful quest armor we've ever seen in the game. Well, now we know how we're going to get it. You can get this armor by doing the put that thing back where it came from. Yeah, put your cock back in your pants achievement. And that achievement has to do with running the new uh, Inf Dawn of the Infinite Mega Dungeon all the way through, killing all the bosses with a single group without anybody dying. 
Not a single death can be had. And if you can do that, you will unlock the infinite dragon flight colorway for this armor. Which is fucking, it's so sexy. I love this colorway. I would love to have it. But you got a hardcore mode this shit. Yeah, that's sick. It is pretty cool, I'm not gonna lie. I like that they're taking inspiration from all the hype around hardcore, wow. And, uh, that's what this is gonna be. So this is gonna be some crazy content to see. People trying to do this without a single death. That's gonna take time, patience, and a whole lot of skill. Three things that many WoW players today don't have. So there you go. We'll see how many people end up getting this. Uh, damn, I guess I'm not getting it. Hey, we'll try to put together groups and make this happen. We'll see. But this, this armor set's cool. I like that they're trying something different. And uh, look forward to giving it an attempt. That's for sure. Mythic upgrade track, retroactive. So if you didn't know this already, 10.1.5 is bringing the myth upgrade track. So, you know, using your crests and shit to upgrade shit, you'll be able to upgrade to 447. Taking a 441 to 447. And some people were like, but what about the gear that I already have that dropped at 441? Blizzard, what about that? Well, Blizzard has responded to that saying, guess what? This upgrade system will be retroactive, meaning if you got a piece of gear today from Mythic Raid, like we're gonna do, and it's 441, it'll be retroactively upgradable so that this upgrade system will be put on it. So the day patch goes live on July 11th, if you got a piece of 441 gear today, all of a sudden you will have two up, three upgradable slots on it, taking it all the way to 444. So that's pretty awesome. Uh, don't feel bad about getting gear today. If it's 441, it's going to be upgradable, which is nice. What's up, Tundra? Myth level ass candy. Oh, my God. Don't I wish. Don't I wish.